Welcome to working with Mad Mapper and using multiple projectors. So what we've got here is just an input file, but if I go over to my quads and I come down here, I've got my quad for the right and my quad for the left. On the right hand side, if we just click on that quad, here's the first quad, and this is going to a smaller projector, a 1280 um, by 800, and over on the right hand side we've got a full high def Projector. So let's just go and have a look at the projectors. Click on the projector tab here. We've got our large projector here, 1920 by 1080, uh, full 1080i, and then the smaller projector number two here. Corresponding to that, just on the projectors, all I do is go and link them up like so, and here's the other projector here, and just make sure you also link it up to the right projector. But for this to work, what you have to do is plug your projectors in first and then open up Man Mapper so it recognizes them. So if we just go back to the multiple screen here, we've got our internal files or just the separate quads and uh, here they correspond to the right hand side and back to the projector, set your projectors up. You just click to add a projector by the way if you wanted to go more than two. First projector, second projector, that's as simple, simple as it is and then you're going to get this lovely blend uh, between the two because one additional thing I've done here if I just click on this quad and I come down here into my blending options I've just got it blending in from um, the right so it just fades in here and you also see that uh, I've got just an additive of add here so if I just went um, ignore alpha you can see how it's a dark shape here I just want to bring them together so I've got add and you can see this has been added in. So that's setting up multiple projectors with Mad Mapper.